It is a big day on board the battleship Iowa. The retired ship is spending its first Memorial Day in Southern California. Eyewitness News reporter Q McCray is live in San Pedro with a look at what's going on today. Q. Uh, good morning, Philip. And yes, let me start off by giving our viewers at home a live look on board the USS Iowa here. Take a look at all the visitors. This is by far the most visitors they've had on this ship since it permanently docked here on July 7th of last year. So they want to make sure that everybody on board here gets a great experience on board, that they get a good look at all the canyons here, but that they also completely understand USS Iowa's backstory. Welcome aboard. Hundreds of people boarded USS Iowa this Memorial Day to witness a piece of history. But this battleship story extends far beyond what a camera can capture, a story David Canfield is very familiar with. When you look at this ship, you, what you see is 70 years of service. You see 70 years of dedicated people, three or four generations of people um, who have served on board here. And that's what we want to remember. Canfield served on the Iowa as a Navy engineer. He was on board April 19, 1989, when an accidental explosion damaged the ship and killed dozens. When that happened, 47 of my shipmates lost their lives. And so today is the time to stop and remember those people. That's not the story of the Iowa, but it's part of the story of the Iowa. Each of his fallen seamen immortalized on this plaque for everyone to see this Memorial Day. World War II vets Ernest Thompson and Dad Colburn couldn't help but feel a sense of pride while walking the decks. It gives me a chance to think of all of those that served their country and uh, uh, have lost their lives. We're remembering all the people that, that aren't here that have given their lives to serve in, in the wars all over the world. USS Alo Iowa, excuse me, quits selling tickets at 4 p.m. So if you want to come on down and get a closer look at this battleship, you're more than welcome. Everyone's invited. Live from San Pedro, I'm Q McCray, ABC7 Eyewitness News. All right, thanks, Q.